How to cinch your waist on oversized pants. So I was going for this oversized cargo pants look, but I wanted the waist to be high waist and fitted. So I immediately went to the men's department in Goodwill because they always fit me how I want them to fit around my leg area because I love a good silhouette. I love a good, you know, snatch the waist and spread out at the bottom. So all you need is an oversized safety pin, elastic band, a button if you want, and needle and thread. Initially, I ended up measuring my whole waist, but you'll see at the end that you really didn't have to measure your whole waist. I, at first, was going to put the elastic band throughout the whole entire pair of pants. Then I realized, no, I didn't want the whole entire pants to be stretched all the way around. I only wanted the back so the front could still give that high waist moment. So you want to hold your pants up so you can see where you want your scrunch to start. I only wanted mine towards the back. So I made sure to only put my slits. And you want to make sure the slits does not go all the way through both ends of the jeans. You only want it to cut through the first layer of that side. So after I cut out my two slits on both sides, I ended up taking my oversized safety pin putting it through my elastic band and inserting it into the slit that I created. Now this part is the tedious part because you're literally just feeding the safety pin throughout the slit that you made all the way through your pants. It's very easy to just kind of like wiggle it and as you go along you want to kind of scrunch it down and pull up, scrunch it down and pull up just to help it navigate throughout the, sh the jeans or the pants or whatever you're using. You are going to continuously feed the safety pin all the way through the holes until you reach the opposite end of the other hole. Ooh, child, please excuse my nails, y'all. This video is so old, I have been meaning to upload this to YouTube, so please forgive me. So you're just going to slide it all the way through, pull it out boom and bam and thank you ma'am okay it should look a little something like this um i did not want to sew it down i wanted to just add some buttons because you know i was trying to be crafty you know i was trying to be diy queen so i decided to you know grab my little needle and thread i'm not a seamstress at all your girl only knows how to sew wigs and whatnot i will link all of the products that i use below and also give you guys some extra product links for you all to shop for your other thrift store finds but yes i took each of the buttons and i sewed them on opposite ends of the elastic band and this is just to secure the elastic band from you know getting pulled out from either of the ends and I'm not a seamstress or anything, so I just really sewed this button on as I would do a weft on a wig. Because, you know, I got a wig video coming up for y'all. So I literally just tied a knot at the end and I began sewing back and forth just to secure the button. Now, I know there are better ways to do this method, but this is for the girls who are doing this at home, are not trying to go spend a lot of money on fixing up their clothes. This is just a quick, simple way to upcycle your thrift store finds. I mean, these pants were literally, I don't know, I think I might have paid like $3.99, $4. This is not gonna hurt your pockets to just add a button, cut a slit in the elastic band, and then push the button through that slit that you made inside of the elastic band. So I definitely needed to add two more buttons to this so I can make it like an adjustable way. So if I wanted to wear them, you know, at my hips or if I wanted to bring it up to my waist, you should be able to adjust it if you add two more buttons to the pants. But, you know, I got a little lazy, so I said, whatever. <laughs> They're just going to get one button. I know it looks kind of odd. But yeah, once you complete the other side, your look should come out looking something like this. Yeah. And who going to check you? Nobody. You killing them with your $4 thrifted pants on and can't nobody check you. If this helped you, let me know in the comments and let me know what content you guys would like to see next. Bye. That's good.